Hey guys, thank you for checking out our video today. My name's Sean Elders, this is Pinnacle Combat Arts. Like, subscribe, comment down below, hit the bell so you can be notified every time we get a new video. Today we're working on Stick and Dagger. Let's get started. Show you three basic combinations and then how to do it with a partner. So the first one's gonna be, I'm gonna be in my fighting position. I'm gonna put the knight up on the chest here, just like this, and this one in the ready position, okay? So we're gonna start off with the first combo. The first combo is just gonna be a basic four count. So you're gonna be one, two, three, and four. So one, two, three, and four. Now it's important that when you slash, you're using your knuckles to slash as if it is a blade, because if it is a blade, you would be doing it the proper way. When I come into this position, I'm gonna bring my knife up. I'm gonna thrust the chest. Now notice my hips turn as I do so. I bring this to my bicep tricep as I lateral step forward and I slash and then thrust. So one, two, three, four, okay? One, two, three, four. So that's the first combination. So now with a partner, this is the way you'll practice it. You'll start off at a longer distance and move in because both of you are going to do what they call lateral step. So we're in fighting stance here. We're gonna put out our stick just like this, okay? And what's gonna happen is we're gonna start off, we're gonna go one, we're gonna slash just past each other like this, almost like two uh, fighter jets flying past each other. We lateral step, do a number two slash, and then go wrist to wrist, okay? Then we're aiming for the jugular on this. Okay, let's do it from this side. <clears throat> so I'm going one, two, three, and four. Now the side. One, two, three, and four. 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 Okay, so that's the four count. Now we're gonna go to the five count. The five count is going to be in the position where I go, bring my knife to my hip, okay, or to up here. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna slash, do the same exact thing, but this time I'm gonna go high and then I'm gonna go low. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, and five. One, two, three, four four and five. One, two, three, four, and five. When I go high and low, I'm going to the jugular, then the femoral, okay? Learn, go, goes on Gray's Anatomy book, read and, and pay attention and learn where all the different main arteries are on the body. So we go one, two, three, four, see that, wrist to wrist, and five, see that? And I wanna target right inside of here, we go here, and we go down in here, okay? So we go one, two, three, four, and five. One, two, three, four, and five. All right, now we're gonna do the third and final combination. Okay, it's real simple. One, two, three, four, five, and six. One, two, three, four, five, and six. So those are the three. Now let's do it with a partner. One, two, three, four, five, and six. One, two, three, four, five, and six. One, two, three, four, five, and six. So what is this? What we're doing right now when we go back and forth with our partner, it's what we call mirror drilling, okay? You're not practicing actually going against an opponent. You're using your partner as a mirror to make sure you're cutting at the proper lines, okay? Developing footwork and range and timing. So when I'm in my position with him and I cut here, I know I'm looking at his neck to cut at his neck when I do that first move, okay? I, I, ga I gauge my position, okay? And when I do that thrust, I'm thrusting, I, and when I'm looking at it in my eye view, I'm looking at his neck when I do that or his chest. So neck and thrash, thrash through, cut through. Step and slash at the number two. When I do that number two, I'm slashing at the neck right here, okay, in my eye view. So we do that position and then we go high. The point of my knife, when I'm looking at that knife, the end of the knife, it should be going right to the jugular and then going low, the femoral. 
Okay, so one, two, three, four, five, and six. Notice we're both rotating our hips. This is teaching you and introducing you to what they call the false lead, okay? When I'm rotating in this position and I go here, okay, that's very important. I'm teaching my body to rotate and drive forward and then my foot back here, my foot, when I step, I go one and two. I'm doing that lateral step, you see? I'm lateral stepping. When I do that, I'm going here and then I rotate. See this? My top half is rotated, but my bottom half hasn't stepped yet. And then I step in. So this introduction to, you can use this in empty hand, knife work, all that stuff. Okay. Very important. All right. All right. So together we're going to go, we're going to do all three of them together now. So four count, one, two, three, four, five count, one, two, three, four, five, six count, one, two, three, four, five, and six. Okay, so those are the three. Again, mirror drilling, okay? You're using that ability to see range, distance, timing. You and your partner working together, and I'll see you next time. Go to our website, pinnaclecombatarts.com. There you can find out more about what I do and the classes that I provide. Thank you guys so much for your support and have a great day.